Hi, I'm Bob Thompson for What's Up. A lot of people mark their calendars for the third week in July because that is the Hiawatha Music Fest that's at Tours Park in Marquette. And here to talk about that is Sarah Gimple. Hello. Thank you for coming. Thanks for having me. Hiawatha, a lot of people look forward to it. Yeah. It's coming uh, July 19th through the 21st it at is. Tourist Park. Yep. Tell us a little bit about the lineup this yeah. year of music. Yes, yeah. so it's a traditional folk music festival. So we have a very diverse lineup this year. Anything from Mongolian throat singers to traditional Cajun folk music and even some local bands that we're really excited to have on main stage. I really like how they mix up the local music with some of these national musicians that yes. are coming in and they're fantastic. Yeah. You never know what you're going to get year after year. You Isn't never do. Fun? Yes. Um, obviously, this um, music festival, the Hiawatha Music Festival, needs volunteers. Yeah. How is that going, and how can people sign up? Yeah, our volunteers are pretty much the backbone of the co-op. Exactly. So we have a lot of slots left open. And the cool part about volunteering is that if you do three shifts throughout the weekend, you get to pay off your advanced ticket sales. So that's why it's important to buy your ticket by July 11th, so then you can work those three shifts and then pay off your ticket. Yeah, and yeah. July 11th will be an important date for yes. people to sign up at the Ordock. The Union Suits will be playing and that's yep. a sign up party. Yep. But that doesn't mean that people can't get their tickets afterwards too. So. Um, the, my last question was the workshops that happen. That's my favorite part, and there'll yeah. be a lot of workshops mm -hmm. happening, right? Yes, absolutely. So there's lots of tents throughout the festival, lots of artist workshops, also lots of tents for kids, just crafts, right. and then a uh, huge area that's called Artists in the Round, where there's lots of artists from uh, just local Marquette area and yeah. around the UP that'll have all of their art up. And it ends on Sunday with the Children's Parade, which is yeah, fun, but then there's fun. obviously music that goes into the night. So yeah. that's it, the July, um, in July 9th, 19th through the 21st will be the Hiawatha Music Festival, traditional music at Tourist Park. If you want more information, you can go to hiawathamusic.org, get your ticket and sign up for volunteers. Mm -hmm. Sarah, thank you very much for coming. Thanks so much for having me. I'm Bob Thompson, and that's mm -hmm. what's up.